Wake up, Mr. Alex. Wakey, wakey, eggs and steaky. Oh, no. I'm having that dream again. Ah, this is no dream, my friend. King Julian is alive and well and taking pictures for our new brochure, Madagascar. Why not give King Julian your vacation money? Yeah, sure. Sounds great. But I need to catch some shut-eye before the big trip back to New York. No! No shut-eyes! Now run, jump, do whatever I tell you to do if you want to make the cover. The butterflies. Nice. You are getting good at this, Mr. Butterfly Catcher. Yes, yes, move it. Way to go, Alex. Melman, where did you come from? And how did you get on top of that boulder? None of these questions have anything to do with pictures I want to take, so I suggest you stop talking and we move on. Hey, can I come with you guys? I have some... <laughs> yes, yes, that is the spirit, Melman. Now let us proceed forward. Hey, okay, fine. Pretty please, with takes us on top. You must get ready to grab these very handsome King Julian coins scattered throughout the island. Besides just the general warm feeling that wealth gives you, these coins can be used to buy merchandise at the duty-free shop. How do I get to the duty-free? I'll show you later. Now double jump to grab this coin and hurry! The camera loves you! Everyone else loves me, but the camera loves you. Yes, you have my blood. Whoa, Marty! You've got some serious wheels there. You don't know this, but I've been scarfing down carrots day and night. Crunch, crunch, crunch. In an effort to develop a super fast sprint ability. Go ahead, buddy. Clock me. Oh, you're pretty fast, Marty, but I bet you can't catch me! Come on now, Mort. Ain't no way a little squirt can outrun a thoroughbred like me. Many things about Mort do not make sense, and one is that he can run like the wind. Why don't you two give us a spectacular race? Go. Ready? Congratulations! I knew Mort would lose. Now the winner gets to kick his favorite soccer ball. Hey! Quiet, you. So, Marty, some of my careless Lima subjects found the royal stash of balloons and are now stuck floating in the air like dopes. Will you please pop the balloons and rescue them? I can't believe you actually did it! My ball! Kick the bonus balloon! You are my hero! Nice job, Marty. Now, stand back and watch how it's supposed to be done. What are you trying to say, Alex? I ain't got no game? No, I'm saying that you don't have any game. Okay, okay. You angry giants can trash speak on the soccer field. But now, I need some more photos of Alex.
bang. We have much to do and... My royal rocks! Put them down, fancy chickens! Please, scare those cuckoo birds away from my beloved rocks! Now! Mr. Alex, you must save my rocks! And they are worth their weight in rocks! I did it! Birds be gone! Help! Birds be back! My rock, I might miss it if you make your sound. Okay, anyone. Anyone. Except that one. Oh, Mr. Alex. Your reward for chasing away the birdies is a fantastic ride on a zip vine. Jump up high and really hang on, or you'll fall off and land on your behind. You did very well, but unfortunately, you are not a hippo. I need photos of Miss Gloria now. I will find her, then meet you at the soccer field. Wish me happy hippo hunting. Oh, Gloria, it is good to see that you can now swim. Too bad you are not as fast as I am. You, a lemur, swimming in a lake? I find that hard to believe. Well, I find it hard to believe that you find it hard to believe. And you're right, I have a boat. Are you ready? What about seven? Follow me. I know where I am going. I do live here, you know. Oh, a boulder is now blocking the top of the walkway. Why do these things keep happening? How about I grab that pepper and break through the boulder to clear the path? Hey, that is an excellent idea that I came up with. Busting. I can guarantee that boulder did not see it coming. Follow me. I know where I am going. Oh, found it good for you and good for me for guiding you. You want me to jump really high so you can snap a picture, right? Yes, yes! As high as the tips of your friend Melman's pointy ears or the moon, whichever comes first.
Impressive form, Miss Claudia. Not as impressive as I can dive, of course, because I am king. Swim with me this way. Now swim with me this way. I have just been made aware of a very strange and ridiculous situation. Have you seen your friend Mailman? Uh, isn't that Mailman hanging from the ledge? Mailman! Oh, thank goodness you are here! We need you and your heli-gliding abilities. It is a matter of utmost importance. Utmost importance? Are you sure you want me for the job? Yes. As you can see, many of my royal subjects are currently floating in mid-air when they really should be on the ground licking my toes. We need you to glide around and rescue them. Melvin, you saved their lives! Now let us move on and never speak of floating lemurs again. Go with me this way now. Go with me this way now. Marty, this is your last warning. You'll never be able to score a goal with me in the box. That's why they used to call me the wall. Who? Who used to call you the wall? You never even played soccer. You were calling it land foosball five minutes ago. It's the same basic principle, Marty. You kick the ball, you block the ball, you spin around in somersaults. Guys, guys, please. As far as I'm concerned, you're both full of it. So why don't you stop talking and play? You mess with me, and you make a mess. You're quite good, Mr. Marty. But now I want to play a full game of soccer. I will pick a teammate that will even things out. Board? Sure, bring it on, little man. Tell us how to play. And just to show you how confident we are, I'll barely listen. Well, I won't even give you an explanation then. Many thanks to all who helped make this brochure. Now one last picture of us and it's off to the printer. Well, that covers everything on the agenda, right Maurice? Sir, don't we have to load the plane, fly the giants home and have all sorts of misadventures? This always happens when I don't write things down. Oh, my goodness! Explosions again! Just when you thought it was safe to go back into the jungle! Boom! Not safe. Look, sir! It's a no! And he's stealing parts of the plane! Well, of course he is, Boris. What else do you expect them all to do? They have very boring lives. But don't we need those parts for the plane to actually fly us back to New York? Hmm. That is a good point. 
and I have a good idea. You, mailman, are you going to be the one to stop those moles from stealing our parts? Ah, uh, it's mailman. All right, mailman. Here we go. Just use your head bash move to knock those moles into next week before they escape with the parts. <laughs> okay, okay. Now's the time when it gets really wacky. On some walls you can use only the spin attack, while on others you can only use the head bash. Let the madness begin! Goodness you're here. I feel a favor coming on. It's this luggage. King Julian has a tendency to overpack. Stuff he doesn't even need, like hay. Who packs hay? And now I can't even get these suitcases closed. Lucky for you, I know just how to deal with it. I've got a butt bounce move that will shut those things, but good. Why, thank you very much, Miss Gloria. Your butt has saved my precious hay. Now I still need to load my suitcases onto the plane. Luckily, I have found the perfect man for the job. He means me, Mort. Why, yes, it is Marty. Mort, I am not even sure why you are still standing there. Mr. Marty, why don't you use that big, sturdy kick of yours to start loading the luggage?
All right. Now, let's hope nobody notices those dents and hoof marks all over their suitcases. Okay, mailman. I now would like you to use your amazing climbing abilities. I don't have any amazing climbing abilities, and the name is Melman, not Mailman. I'm pretty sure it's Mailman. The one that can do all of the climbing flippy business. I think you're talking about me. Well, whoever I'm talking about, please get up to those platforms and help secure those ropes. Alex, just tie the ropes together quickly so I'm not stuck down here with a guy who keeps trying to buy stamps off me. These shiny rivets will help you find the rivets. really enjoy balancing on this beam unless you fall off to avoid this tragic scenario push left or right to balance yourself as you walk the faster you walk the faster you lose Repeat the button patterns below, you crazy kitty. That is it, Mr. Alex. A knot to be proud of, but there are more knots in need of your handiwork. Go find them. I was just telling this rope that you're going to tie it into a big, fat, incredible knot. The rope didn't respond with excitement, but do it anyway. Excellent nothing. 
Now all of the ropes are secure. It is a pity your friend Mailman is not here to see your major accomplishment. Where did he go? Mailman will never have a smooth takeoff without a smooth runway. And we'll never have a smooth runway with those rivets sticking up. We need you to pound them down. Uh, I'm still a little dizzy and nauseous from the mole experience. Well, this ought to fix you right up then. All you need to do is use your head, or use your head, or use your head. Why do you keep repeating that? It's called a hint, Einstein. You need to use your head bashability. Press the special button near a rivet and you'll see what I mean. without getting a concussion. Hey, is this a great day or what? Oh, thank goodness you are here. I cannot tell you how important it is that we test out the aiming system on this slingshot. That important, huh? I said I cannot tell you how important it is. I wish your giant freaks would listen. Anyway, before we launch the plane, we need to make sure our aiming system works, and to do that, you need to shoot Mort from this slingshot. Me? There is no one else I trust to be flung through the air at such high and dangerous speed. Indeed, I could watch that over and over and over and... Playtime is over, pal. We gotta get these vines in locked position. We are ready to launch the plane. Well, I suppose there are only so many times we can shoot Mort out of a tree before it loses its meaning. But how will you get these vines stretched all the way back? I can help you out with that, provided you have some peppers. We do. I'll have my most steady throwing subject toss them. But I warn you, he's not so steady. That vine in position, we're prepared for launch. Oh, this popsicle stand. 